Horizon Chance Room CG Reacts and this is obliterating the land speed record in Kerbal Space Program by the channel Martin Side of Hands Live. This is secondary channel. To me, both are the same because uh, th there is no reducing in quality. But both are the awesome, uh, you know, channels basically. He uploads awesome videos in both of them. I guess he, uh, he, uh, you know, creates certain type of a setup like I'm gonna make this kind of video for my main channel. Any kind of spin-off ideas like this, I guess. He did this, like, you know, Kerbal Space Program, like, what, three videos, I guess he did it, right? Uh, awesome ones. And he just realized, wait a minute, I'll just do the land speed thing. And he just put his secondary channel, yeah. So basically, he's got, see, Martin Sato Pants and Kerbal Space Program, this is the best thing ever, right? Obviously, I love the, you know, uh, those, the, that car mechanic thing, uh, which he's still doing, right? I, I guess he's going to post another video about it. Uh, last time, you know, that uh, drunk guy, uh, you know, hung himself and I'm like, what the fuck? That was the best game ever. But Kerbal Space Program, I like, because he has, a, I, th I guess, degree in physics, right, if I remember correctly. And this Kerbal Space Program is really good in basically, you know, figuring physics out. And, you know, there's lots of physics and math is involved. So I guess it's going to do the same thing here. So it's going to be awesome. Let's go to the, let's go back to the drawing board, basically. He's going to do a lot of that. So let's do it. Hello again, gents, and welcome back to the live channel. Today, we are partaking in Kerbal Space Program's greatest challenge, breaking the land speed record. A challenge that not a single other soul on all of YouTube has oh, okay. ever tried before. The rules are simple. Go as fast as possible while in contact with the ground. To get up to speed, anything can be used. Electric motors, jet engines, rockets, and all sorts of other more interesting forms of repulsion. The highest speed ever achieved by a real human being without leaving the ground was 1,227 kilometers an hour. Damn! was essentially a bucket with two jet engines strapped to its sides. At yeah. the altitude it was running, this speed was a tiny bit over the speed of sound. Very, very quick. Tiny bit. But we can do better. Especially because our pilots will have little to no regard for their own life. So, let us begin. Tonk 3. Can't forget about Tonk 3. All right, why don't we why don't we go for the land speed record in Tonk Three? See how fast it can really go. We began our first attempt with a beautiful <laughs> vessel I had Fuck used that, in this mates. video. Tonk Three. I'll just drive. W. Let's go. Off the line and away we go. Ignite. Almost there. Almost there. No one has ever made a car this fast. Oh. Damn. Tonk Three was slow, but it did get up to about 35 minutes per second. Our new personal best. I guess if I just used a plane, right, and didn't take off, would that count as the land speed record? Hmm. Oh, but you know what? Okay, we're gonna do, we're gonna go for some weight reduction. Don't need that. Don't need that. Uh, or these. Or these. Do we want to slow down? Do we want to stop at the end? Right? Wouldn't that be smart to not kill every single Kerbal that uh, attempts the land speed record? No. No, no, no. <laughs> Not a single person is saying yes. Ooh. Since I removed all those parts, we're a bit butt heavy. Uh. Okay. Uh. Is the front wheel steering? How am I. How am I turning this? Uh oh. <laughs> no way! Alright, we actually. <laughs> All I go is saying how am I turning this? It's a glider at this point. <laughs> it's a jet engine behind with uh, aerodynamics and there's very small wheels below. Yeah, at that point, if it starts to spin, that's it. <laughs> Die. What was our highest speed over land? 175 meters per second. This speed was a lie. Our actual fastest speed was 141 meters per second, which was our new personal best. All right, enough dilly-dallying. It was time to design a craft to go very, very fast. But first, do you know what we need to talk about? Enlisted. That's right, boyos, you have been drafted into Enlisted, the greatest World War II multiplayer shooter ever created, what built the by the same fuck? guys that did War Titan. Enlisted offers the infantry side of World War II warfare. And guess what? It's completely free. Historical accuracy? You guessed it. Extreme historical accuracy is present within this video game. Personally, my favorite feature in Enlisted is the ability to play as multiple men as one man. That's right, you do not play as a solitary soldier, but as an entire squad. Simply press the Y key and your soul will move from one squad mate to another in the blink of an eye. What does this mean? Constant action. Oh no, I'm dead. Psych, I'm this guy. Now. Oh no, I'm dead again. Psych! I'm this guy now. My favorite weapon, of course, it's this Sturm pistol thing. Think regular pistol, but larger. 
Remember the incredibly detailed tanks and aircraft from Ward Hunter? Well, they're back, baby! The detail goes all the way down to the smallest detail. Guess what, boyos? I have a special offer for you. Enlist with my link at the top of the description and receive a bunch of free stuff. Three days of premium time and several special troops and weapons. This is all well. I'm on the beaches of Normandy. The Americans are coming. And guess what? MG42. <laughs> Gentlemen, download Enlisted now with my link in the description for free and get your exclusive bonus. Play on PC, PS5, Xbox Series X and S or any other previous generation console. Now. <clears throat> all right. Enough dilly-dallying, it was time to design a craft to go very, very fast. Ooh, and here she is. what the fuck? I've never seen much of NASCAR uh, videos, obviously mostly by movies and TV shows. It was time to but design this a craft is to go very Oh, why? Okay, why are these all these people standing here at the, you know, this railing? First of all, this didn't used to exist, right? Until certain cars flew in and basically killed certain spectators. And they said, okay, I guess we have to put these railings here. But even then, these railings are not that strong. I've seen videos where cars literally crash and jump here and it just, you know, basically collapses there. All these people are just standing here. And, you know, it doesn't take that long for, you know, things to go wrong because all these cars are way too close. Wait a minute. Very, very Look at the way too close. One touch and everything will basically start to crash. These people are really brave. The same as rally people, right? When the rally race is going, people are there at the dirt road, very close. Like, what the fuck? Fast. And here she is. The amazing. The incredible. Yeah. Featuring one solid rocket booster and these, uh, wide wheels. Surely this craft would deliver some incredible results. Oh, God. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Why? Uh, come on, man. Come on, man. That's just not fair. This is All a right, different well, universe with different laws of physics. And that, okay. That's, that's in the air. That's not on the ground. And I'm dead. What? Why? Why did it do that? Why? Definitely need these wheels. Okay. I have a good feeling about this. Yeg is going to go very, very fast. Okay. Erming Kerman, prepare to meet your maker. Okay. Oh, f fuck! <laughs> no. That's way too powerful Shit. rocket, that's the problem. Yeah. Damn. Next, I tried adding some wings. It didn't help. Look, I can actually drive it a bit with the, the wheels themselves, and then... Whoa! Actually, okay. you're supposed to do that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. That's great. That's just what I wanted. It's incredible. Maybe Erming Kerman won't die because I'll just, he'll jump out. Deploy shoot. He's safe. Okay, what happens if I just slam him into the ground? Damn. After a couple more iterations of our beautiful craft, Yeg, We'd inched our top speed up to 236.9 meters per second. A decent speed, but I knew we had far more to gain. Especially if every single craft didn't fly off the runway immediately and explode. So, it was time for a fundamental redesign. Ladies and gentlemen, introducing Yeg V2. Rocket nuts. For the rocket. Now surely, this craft would go at incredible speeds. Uh, what the fuck? What? Is the problem with this is that this game this game was made to I guess go to space right? It's a space program, so there the game kind of assumes you're gonna go up right? Doesn't matter how much mechanics and physics they used in this game, there's gonna be limitation. It's not really a simulation in the end. I mean, true simulation is a game right? So I guess that's why all these weird physics are happening when it's trying to I guess just go fast on the tarmac right? Obviously, it's gonna st start to fly up. Hi. Why is it so fucking bouncy? Stop! Turn over. Yes, go! Yeah, no. No, don't fall. And going up. Okay, that, that invalidates the speed record. This would be great if, you know, if this was on the ground. <laughs> That's pretty fast. What happens if I were to jump out right now? Damn. After removing a bunch of mods which were probably causing those wheel issues, Sigma! We got back to work on a new vessel. What's true, if you're going across that way and rocket starts, you, you're not just gonna go up, there are no wings there, basically it's gonna start to tip down from the front, right? Because propulsion is from the backside, I don't know. 
Gig V3. So far, our personal best speed was 236.9 meters per second, but Yeg Damn. V3 would set a new, far better record. Three, two, one, go! Oh my god! It works! <laughs> Holy fuck! <laughs> that, was, that was some serious speed. Yeg V3 had reached a massive 581.1 meters per second before launching Ooh. itself off the runway and into the ocean a new personal best. The next few launches, however, were not quite so successful. Three, two, one. Go. Oh. oh my god. No. All right. Three, two, one, go. Oh my god. No. <laughs> Fuck. Let's try it again. Three, two, one, go. No. <laughs> Shit. Okay. Yeah. And then it just does that. And then it just does that. That's awesome. That's great. That's sick. Let's give it another try. Three, two, one, go. Oh. Three, two, one, go. Nope. All right. Let's try this again. Go. Boy, what? Ooh, five hundred. Man, that was five sixty or something. That's just not fair. Okay, I guess we're just going with this one then. Clearly, Yeg V3's design was far better than these other unstable pieces of garbage. But you know what Yeg V3 needed to go even faster? Of course. It needed more engines. Huh. <laughs> oh. No, don't fly. Don't take off. No, don't take off. Stop. 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 <laughs> Fuck. Shit. Okay. Three, two, one, go. Oh, yes. No, Speed. man. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> Ooh. What? Why not? You know, why not? Fuck it. Went why to not? 600, I think. Yeah, why that's not? 100%. That's like, what, 2,000 plus something three, kilometers. Two, one, go. Yeah. Oh, no. <laughs> it's, overheated. it's like 2,000 km per hour, right? Alright. Okay, I think it was... Which engine exploded? I think it was this one. Which means I just gotta space these out a little more. No, not like that. Like this. Oh. <laughs> it's beautiful. Okay. 3, 2, 1, go! Oh, yes! Speed! Oh my god! Ooh. Oh, I think we got Went 800. To 800. <laughs> that was really good. Is it gonna survive? What? What? <laughs> what the fuck? It's become a paddle boat. Oh my god! What's happening to the land? Ah! Before our beautiful vessel morphed into a paddle boat, it had managed to reach 837.5 meters per second, our new personal record. At this point, the limiting factor was not so much our craft, but the length of the runway. Of course, if our craft could accelerate faster, then it could reach a higher speed before launching itself, but building such a craft turned out to be much harder than anticipated. All right, I think it's separate run time. We are here to go fast, okay? We are here <laughs> to go very fast. Whatever. Three, two, one, go! What is this? <laughs> oh my god. god damn. What's happening? It didn't go that fast. I don't know what that was. I think the engine was kind of lagging because it was still at a 300 meter per second. So, you know, it was lagging because it felt like it's going to go way too fast, but that wasn't the case. Okay, so 800 meter. What is that? Like 3000 kilometer per hour? 800 by uh, 800 meters by 60, then by... Uh, then by 60 and that's meters so trying to kilometer out or something like that that was interesting you know what i have an idea for something totally new and different jeff yep it's jeff jeff was bad go <laughs> okay it's pretty quick it's pretty quick i will admit it is pretty quick 
So Top Gear created their own car and they named him, or Clarkson named him, GF with a G. So I guess it's kind of close. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> they think alike, apparently. <laughs> Shit. Alright, three, two, one, go! <laughs> Wanna stilt? Come on. For sake. Okay, I don't think Jeff is gonna work. I then built something completely different. Fuck it, three, two, one, go! Just simply rockets. It's doing it! Yes! Nope, the other one was better. Okay. <laughs> it reached 800 at least. I tried the same thing, but instead, with liquid fuel. Three, two, one, go! Ooh, it's fast. Maybe, oh. <laughs> And who'd have guessed, the inevitable happened. This time, with less boosters. Three, two, one, go! Oh yes! This is even more faster, Speed. damn. Speed! <laughs> Stay going. <laughs> and this time, I put more engines on it. Let's do it. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> <laughs> more power. Yes! Three, two, one, go. Oh, they're a bit hot. It's a bit warm. Go. Yes! Speed! Ooh, it's doing it. Oh my god. Three, two, one, go. Wow! Speed! Speed! Oh, one of them fell off. Ugh. <laughs> Eventually, I figured I needed a longer runway, and I knew just the place. Kerbin's North Pole. For some reason, it's perfectly flat. And all I had to do was get there. Whee! This is how we go. To the poles. Very fast. Place vessel. Fellas. Big things are about to happen. Is it flat Big. though? Three, two, one, go! Alright. Okay. Stable. Oh boy. Oh boy. We better get speedy. I don't get this. Why is it so slow? Oh. 600. Oh. Oh, it's getting a bit unstable. 700. Okay. 800. <laughs> 850. <laughs> All right, what I don't understand is how those spindly small le uh, tires are actually <laughs> sustaining this level of speed. 893 meter per second, damn. Did you see that? That's not fair. This run would be the fastest I would do by conventional means. We reached 893 meters per second before the ground decided it was hungry and ate the craft. From here, I built a few more things. Some were particularly good at making noise. But none of them could match our record of 893 meters per second. That is, of course, until I started being... Yeah, I don't get it. The, you know, the first crop that reached 800 meters, it didn't have that many boosters in it. And then he started to add just boosters with wheel and it still didn't go near that speed. I don't get this. What's happening there? Why with more power and less weight, you can't go much faster? I mean, you'd say aerodynamics, but these are rocket boosters that have aerodynamics already. Even more silly. Railgun? Railgun? Alright. For our next build, we would not be launching a craft, but a Kerbal. Okay, it's time to collect some very important data. Okay, Jeb, goodbye. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Oh no, poor Jeb. <laughs> Let's try it again. Let's do it again. Jeb, my man. My man. Please, stand on the platform so we can do the experiment. Okay, let's turn on uh, all these things so that he doesn't overheat and explode. On three. One, two, three, go! Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute, I can do it again. One, two, three, go! <laughs> oh. He didn't die. On three. One, 
two, three. Send it. <laughs> uh, shoot. This new technology was proving quite promising, especially because all we needed to do to get him to go further was add more thrust. In. There we go. <laughs> Goodbye, Bob. On three. One, two, three, and... <laughs> oh, that wasn't even... Oh, man. It wasn't even that strong. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> Goodbye, Jeb. Three, two, one, go! Where'd he go? I'm not fucking around anymore, Jeb. He's about to be sent. One, two, three, go! Jeb is not doing much. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> how fast was that? 2,000 meters per Whoa. second. This is how we get the land speed record. We shoot Jeb at the ground at 2,000 meters per second. On three. One, two, three, go. Yeah, so... First of all, I thought... The <laughs> I thought the thing he was doing is just creating some kind of a vehicle that goes faster. I guess he did that so far. But now I guess he's saying, fuck it, let's just send Jeb faster. Is that it? That doesn't really break the record. <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? <laughs> On three. One, two, three, go. <laughs> yes. Okay, I have another idea. We make the booster larger. Speed. Okay, three, two, one, go. Give it a bit. Give it a minute. Come on, man. This is so disappointing. Please. Oh! <laughs> How was that? <laughs> there we have it, boys. <laughs> the land what speed the record. Now, this is fast. But we can go faster. Oh! Jeb. <laughs> Are you okay? Oh! What happened? I think he hit the ground. Um, Let's see if we can reach a million meters per second with Mr. Jeb. This is really 300,000, so I guess it you took could. a lot of finagling, lots of adjustment, and lots of dropping Jeb on his head over and over again. Until, of course, it actually worked. Oh my god. Oh. What the hell you went to space? <laughs> <laughs> you got to be kidding me. And gentlemen, this is what there happened. Is the land speed record. At the end of the day, we had managed to claim an absolutely 100% real land speed record of 1.8 billion meters per second. What the fuck? God damn, so I, this, he just went vertical so fast, he just went out of the planet. So he didn't hit anything in the way, I guess. He, he just, you know, I, I'm pretty sure it was horizontal, right? It wasn't pointing up. So he just went all the way out. Second. That's, uh, pretty quick. Way too quick. A quick thanks once again. Oh, there you go, I guess. <laughs> okay, I can see how this is a secondary video. It was just, you know, yeah, messing around with the land speed record. I'm surprised how you can do many different things in Kerbal Space Program, right? I mean, this is a really simulator game, let's just say. Simulator type of game, because they thought of all the details in it. Because why why would they even think that, you know, <laughs> Kerbal can go this fast and register a billion meters per second or something? But yeah, they're like, fuck it. Let's just add certain scripts that acts like a laws of physics. So there you go. Well, people, that was obliterating the land speed recording Kerbal Space Program by the channel Martin Side of Pants. If you like my reaction, don't forget to subscribe. And I'll see you next time.